a woman from UK found an ancient Roman stone in her private garden. If you are a owner of a garden, you should definitely check every rock in your property, as it might turn out to be something very valuable, not only in terms of money, but actually a relic from ancient times. That's what happened recently with an average woman from UK which decided to turn upside down a strange looking rock that she found in her garden. Recently, a group of English archaeologists have been notified about a discovery of a mysterious slab of rock which was found in the most unusual of the places. The object turned out to be an ancient artifact, a Roman relic from a long past. Welcome to Mos Maiorum. Here, we publish content weekly about the ancient world, travel and history. If you want to know more about the world around us and the past, subscribe to our channel. A woman living in the County Hampshire, located in South East England, has discovered that a rock that she found over 20 years ago and was used as a mounting block for her stable for the last 10 years is actually worth around 20,000 US dollars. During the years that she was using the rock at her stable, some debris of the stone surface have washed away and the owner noticed that the rock has strange carvings. After taking it to a local archaeologist for analysis, she was told that the piece of the rock is actually an over 2,000 year old Roman artifact. The experts believe that the object is from the 2nd century AD and has a Greek and East Roman origin. The first analysis confirmed that the material is marble and it has engraved two large wreaths and an inscription below them which reads The people and the young man, the honorable, Demetrius, son of Metrodorus, the son of Leucius. Most of what is nowadays the UK were part of the Roman Empire during the 2nd century AD. However, Latin was the most popular language among the British Romans around this time, and not Greek. The specialists believe that based on the rock type, it was transported to this area two centuries ago during the Grand Tours. The Grand Tours were basically a tradition of rich aristocrats of the 17th and 18th century of doing tours over Europe learning about classical culture and art. However, besides this theory of how the rock ended up in the country, there is still the mystery of how the rock ended up in a private garden. Unfortunately, there is not much information about the origin of the discovered artifact at this moment. And antique specialists are looking for any information from the public to trace the roots of the objects that end up in the woman garden. The blocks of the rural house where the stone was initially found were built in the year of 1960. The specialists are hoping that maybe somebody who lived in the area at the time or anybody who was working during the time of this house were built would recall an origin of the material used on the construction. Following the discovery, the woman who owns the artifact 
is looking to sell the object and it has been set to be auctioned. By finds like that, we can have an idea of how big the Roman Empire was, an empire who extended itself from England all over Europe, North Africa and the Middle East, extending three continents. And also, all the time, archaeologists are giving us news on remarkable new discoveries and always full of fascinating stories around them. If you enjoyed this content and you want to know more, please like and subscribe. And don't forget to press the bell icon to stay tuned on more updates on Mos Maiorum. We publish videos like this every week. Tibi gratis agu. Pro Vigilabo.